A local fire department is getting ready to celebrate a big milestone. Angela Kelly joins us live from Seymour this morning with more. Good morning, Ange. Hey, good morning, everybody. This July, it will be 100 years since the city of Seymour officially got its own fire department. You are looking at a pumper truck that was used in 1926. And since then, they've obviously had some serious upgrades. I'd like to introduce you to um, Fire Chief Steve Krabby. Good morning. Good morning. So um, you've got your crew up working now. Yes, yes, we're doing a little cleanup and uh, normal maintenance. So uh, tell us the significance of celebrating 100 years of being a volunteer fire department. Well, I think the, the biggest thing about it shows the, the loyalty and the dedication that volunteers have for their small communities, knowing that they have full-time jobs that they have to take care of. Uh, it's amazing that this many men would give up this much of their life to uh, help others that they may not even know. Yeah, a, a lot of the, the guys uh, that you're looking at now, uh, they're in here doing what this morning? Well, this morning we've got uh, some of our explorers back on our uh, tanker, kind of getting that polished up and ready to go. We always keep things nice and neat and clean around here. Uh, the JAWS equipment for rescue needs to be checked and rechecked, and uh, the SCBAs, of course, that's their, their lifeline when they're in a fire. That gets checked on a very regular basis. So. Uh, and, just normal maintenance right now. Yeah, and you, you think of, you know, how early it is in the morning right now. These guys are up, and you guys, this is a, a duty. They have to do this, but it's on a volunteer basis. They've got regular full-time jobs to go to. I mean, that speaks volumes of their dedication. That, that's true, and I, we want to thank you for the heads up this morning. We don't usually get that much of a notice. It's usually in a matter of minutes that we have to be ready to go. So uh, these men do have full-time jobs, regular jobs, and... Uh, we get calls day and night, and just never know when, so we're ready at a moment's notice. Let's talk about um, the big anniversary celebration that you've got coming up in June. Okay. Yeah, the day is going to be a fun-filled day, and it was designed, uh, we started uh, planning this about four years ago, and the, uh, the whole day is planned around family, and of course, because we're heavy into tradition and family and the fire service. So uh, we decided to do a, a nice parade of all uh, older vintage uh, fire vehicles and uh, businesses in town if they would like to do something. Uh, as far as the parade starts at 2 o'clock, uh, it goes down to the fairgrounds area in Seymour. We're at 3.30. Uh, we start with Boogie and the Yo-Yos for a band to entertain until our big stage show goes on, which is the Oak Ridge Boys National Known Act. They'll be on the main stage uh, from 8 until about 9.30, quarter to 10. And our real quick, Chief, uh, tickets for that concert go on sale tomorrow. How they, can people get them? They do. They could come right here to the station. They are $5 a person. That's our big sell right there is that we're doing for the family. So $5 a person at the station at 11 o'clock tomorrow or Bay Lake Bank, Seymour Branch only from uh, 11 till noon they're open and then from then on all the regular business hours. All right. Thanks, Chief. Yeah. We are going to be spending the whole morning with this fire department. I cannot wait. I'm going to get geared up. Uh, maybe talking about put me up in the ladder truck. We'll Ooh, see what happens. Cool. It's going to be a fun morning. Sounds yeah. like it. Thanks, Ange. See ya. Have fun.